What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on the Dark Knight playthrough. It's time to defeat Dastard Beg. So let's go ahead and summon him. I think, okay, never mind. This one has a dark portal too. I just didn't see the portal. So there we go, let's pop it. Let's dance, Dastard Beg. Such a weird name for an enemy. Hello, can can my character move? What is my character doing? Oh my gosh. Not dastard, not this attack. Get up. Get okay, get up, get up, hurry up. Just slack him once. Oh my gosh, I missed my one. What? He's not dead? Just touch him once. There we go. Oh my gosh. That was almost tragic. I don't want to tell you and scare you before, but he was a lot stronger than you think. You've grown quite strong. All thanks to me, right? Hee <laughs> hee. Alright. Permanent token. Right. We've got what we came here for. Now let's head back to that scary lynch woman. She obviously lost something valuable when her barn burned down. Maybe she'll be more willing to cooperate if we find it for her. And I think I know where that little sparkling item might be. Got the gift from the black spirit. Pop this open real quick. Hello. Complete that. Okay, so let's auto path and I'll do some inventory management. Okay, so we got the Steed Kriegsmeyer. We actually have five black stone weapons. Have actually a decent fair amount of money on this account. Need to sell this. It's actually worth two mil. So I definitely, 2.2 mil, I definitely need to sell that. We do have some valuables on this account. Let's see. Um, I don't know if we actually circle back to Heidel, but I know Glish doesn't have a central market, which is really stupid. I always thought it did, but I guess it doesn't. Which is really kind of dumb. It doesn't make any sense to me. It's a major town, like, Why? Okay, so we reach level 25 on a different character. We have that available. I'm not going to claim it on here. I claim pretty much everything on my sorceress. Because I just think it makes more sense. The sorceress is where I hoard all my items and stuff like that anyway. It's where I farm. It's where I do all that stuff. So I might as well just do it on there. I mean, all the stuff is shared between my accounts pretty much. So found the silver ring. Really? Get out of here. I wonder what I could go farm with what I have on. Maybe that's what we'll do in this episode. We'll, we're going to do something different. I mean, just because I always do the conventional crap on here. I'm just like, oh, we go to the next area. And then the next area after that. So hold on. Oh, Marana. My promise to Marana. Thank you, adventurer. If it wasn't for you, I might have lost my mind. Uh, I know you're my, here for my debt to the League of Merchants, but I honestly do not possess enough money to pay it back. I gathered everything I could while you were here away. If you could see if they will let me have another week. Oi, you there. What are you eating? Did you even do any work for us today? Ugh. Okay. So normally we would go talk to Bobby Lauren, but I need the Central Market. So let's see here. Central Market. But one thing... So we're 19, which means usually I go here, but let we're going to go try to... Oh, do we want to try Bloody Monastery? I, I think that's too easy if I buy some gear here. So let me see here. Let me pull up my little... I have a, I have a sheet with where I want to... My different farming spots. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, let's just have this auto path. Um, what's after that? 30? The Karudo Caves is next. And then it's Abandoned Land. Abandoned Land is for 35 to 40. But if I get my defense up... I think Karudo Caves is the next, but I don't even know where Karudo Caves is. There's Keplin Mine. Where the heck is the Karudo Caves at? There's Hexe. Karudo Caves. Oh, there's Karudo. Okay. So that's where... I think we're going to try that, maybe. That's for 30 to 35, but it's the, I don't know. I think right here is where I want. This is the Karudo Cave, I think. Let me take a look. Let me zoom in here. So, it 
shows on the map. Is this it? I, th I can't tell. I guess so? Well, maybe. I don't know. It's gotta be right there. It wouldn't make any sense for it to be anywhere else. Okay, so if it's here... This is kind of odd. Well, I guess it's talking about this. Maybe that one or this one. I don't know. The picture that I'm looking at is a little off, but it looks like, yeah. Yeah, it's over here. It's right... Oh, uh, Karudo Cave, right there. Okay, I found it. I found it. <laughs> Took us a second, but that's where we're going to go. We're going to check that out, see if we're strong enough to do that. Might as well have a little bit of fun. We have all this stuff for sale here. Anything sell? Oh, uh, yeah. Collect this stuff. We have 43 million now. Like I said, I've been farming on my main character. So, we we are getting some money. Okay, so I want to put this into... Oh, it's not full durability. We want to put all of this stuff in. Can, uh, it's not for full durability. Put that in. Put that in. Put that in. Okay. So I need to go. There's a blacksmith down here, luckily. Like, right here. So I can repair all my stuff. Okay. Repair equipped. Repair inventory. And now I need your regular shop. Because I need to sell. Okay, so I can't... I gotta sell all of this stuff. None of this stuff is stuff that I can list. Sell those. Sell those. Alright. And then... I think he's right down here, right? We'll get that 60k real quick. I have 40 million, so I'm willing to spend... I'm probably willing to spend about 20 million. I'm going to farm heavily tonight, I think. Now I don't... Yeah, that this is going up the same day I'm talking, referring to. So, yeah, tonight, when you're seeing this video, I'm going to heavily farm tonight. Maybe try to pull her in, like, two or three hours on my sorceress of farming. So I should get some cash back. So that's why I'm kind of willing to, to blow a little bit of money here. Usually I would want to save, but... I'm willing to blow it a little bit. You can entrust your goods without worry, okay, so we can send this stuff now. The head of the magic guild. Send that. Okay. We can list all of these. I like how they just sell instantly. It's so nice. Um, this is the one we can sell. Sell that. So is it, uh, it's back doing that stupid thing where it's not letting me sell. I might be full on my auction house, which is fine. These things aren't that expensive. I don't care. Oh, no. It's letting me sell these things. I need to get this on the auction house. 2.2 mil. Beautiful. Oh, it's sold already. Nice. I'll try to sell this one more time. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so we have 4.6 almost 4.7 mil if you include what i have on me so i'm gonna deposit all that so now we have 4.73 million i could i would really love to get a better a maxed out kriegs me sir i don't know i don't think that's gonna be possible that's the one we have no we have the uria kriegs me sir now I mean, I'm going to have to find a plus 15 one for it to even be worth considering, which I'm not seeing any. No. We're pretty much stuck with what I got. Korea? Nope. They're all the basics. Oops, I clicked on the wrong thing. Yeah, we're stuck with what we got, which is fine. Which is fine. But now we need to upgrade our armor. I think the Xerath is, what, is like my favorite. I don't need the pry... Like, this might be good enough. The plus 10 might be good enough. Plus 12 is 7 million. 5. So that's 30. I mean, that the, the upgrade in paying is just... I think the plus 10 is fine. Granted, there's a plus 10. Okay, there is a plus 10 Xerath helmet. Xerath armor. There's only... Okay, let's skip the armor for now. Gloves... 
I don't know why I like Zara so much. Is it plus 10? Because I'll play for the plus 10. If it's a higher, I probably won't. Okay, it was plus 10. Okay, nice. Shoes, Zareth. Plus 13 for 16 mil. Is there a plus 9 here? I'll buy the plus 9. Yes, okay, there was a plus 9. Um, I will buy the plus 9 armor as well. For 4 mil. Or a little bit over 4, 3. Okay, okay, we, we had them all. Okay. So we have two plus tens, two plus nine armors on this character now. So let's throw those on. Okay, so we're at 95, 110. It's a good thing I checked this because I definitely needed to give my workers beer. Let's put the horse down here. Hello, put the horse down there. We're gonna use the combat XP. Should actually be able to list these items. Well, we can list three of them. I'm just going to throw them in there. I'll list them later. Don't want to waste any more of your guys' time. Okay. So are we good? Yeah, we have we have the bears, earrings, and necklaces, which, you know, obviously aren't the greatest, but they should get the job done. All right. So now it's time to try this. Let's go over to Karuto Cave. So we have a little bit of, we have a little ways to go. Is our fund in for the day? No, no family fund yet. If you didn't notice, so on the 5th, that was yesterday, we got uh, Kazarka's back. That's the world boss, which I, I, I want to do a video on, but I haven't got to it yet. There were four rewards. Uh, they were all varying forms of black crystals of the armor and the weapon crystals. We got two of them, two bags of five each for armor and weapon. And then we also got a... Do we get the the bigger, like, the black shards? I don't know what they're... The, the black shards, are those the expensive ones? The ones that, if broken down, can be, like, one to four or whatever like that? We got those as well. Not that those are a huge deal. But it was... It ended up being, like, 13 mil or 12 mil or something like that, which was really nice. Could have been better, but that was still decently nice. I need to remember about these. Um, I don't know if the emissary is actually going to still be there to turn these in. Um, when, uh, oops, that's not what I wanted. Oh, the emissary is in Heidel. All right, back. Go, come on, go to the Karuto, Karuto cave. Hopefully, we get it. We get there before. Hopefully, it doesn't take the whole episode to get there. I mean, I'm going to farm there, whether in this episode, what, no matter how long it takes. It could take 10 minutes to run there. We're still going to farm there, at least for a little bit. But I'm interested. I'm really interested to see how this is going to go. It could be really, really stupid. Like, just a trash. Could just be trash, but I'm hoping it's going to be it's gonna be good. But you never, you never actually know. I don't quite know how the how it's going to work because we're under leveled. I mean, you're supposed to be like, what does it say? 27 or something when you be, when you get here. Yeah. 27 to 31 uh, might even be a little bit higher for the actual Karuto cave, but my gear is appropriate. I mean, it's appropriate gear for this level stuff. So it'll be interesting. Let's do that. I always forget to change my map up out, and, and then, then I switch back to that, and I'm like, oh my gosh, where did all my, my all my points of interest go, all my nodes? Am I connected to this node? I can invest energy. I am connected. Okay. Let's invest all of my energy. So we got the... We making good progress here. Yeah, we're getting there. A little bit slower than I'd want it to be, but can I... Hold on, let me look at this. Can I make a shortcut here? I don't want to... Yeah, I think I can I think I think can shortcut here. We're going to try it. It's always a little dicey on the shortcuts. Well, okay, so I two-shot the bandit archers. How much experience do these guys give me? Okay, let's kill this guy. So we're at 90.117. If I kill this guy, what does he give me? I don't know. 
but he's taking... Oh my gosh, die! Um... Like 2%, which isn't really that much. I thought it would be a lot better for... It being, like, way stronger than me. So, this might be just a waste of time. I thought the experience would scale. So, I thought... I thought, like, I would get, like, 5% experience for that kill. And it would level you up really quick. But I'm probably wrong. But now it's too late. We're, we're already going here. We're checking it out. I mean, obviously, you get the skill buffs. So, we have 63 skill points. I need to do this real quick. Um, bleeding damage of 20 inflicted on a good last hit. Let's get that. Unveiled dagger. I want that. Hidden strike. I want shadow bullet one. I want darkness burst. I mean, I think I can just get everything, right? I can just get everything. <laughs> I, can, I can get everything and still have points left over. Okay. Well, that's nice. We're about to find out if this is even worth it. I have a feeling it is not worth it, but, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're trying it anyway, because we're already, like, 90% of the way here. I guess my thought process... I thought I think my thought process was fine. It just turns out it's just a little bit flawed. It, it makes sense. It's just a... It's just a wee bit flawed. Just a wee bit flawed. Because of... Because of, you know... Because of the fact that we, uh... What am I trying to say? Because of the fact that it doesn't scale the experience, I don't think. Where are we? Can I cut through the forest now? Yeah, I can cut through the forest now. Save ourselves a little bit of time. Okay, let's see how bad I get destroyed here. Because that's also an option. Can I please... I can't jump over this, really. Okay. Guess I'll just run right over here. Alright. Come on. There we go. Well, they don't actually hit me that hard, but... Um... I don't think we're not getting like a ungodly amount of experience, but I will say we are getting some we're, we got some experience like I don't know We're not getting like a crazy amount of experience, but we are getting like experience. I don't know how else to explain it. Oh My gosh Well, we're in Karuto cave now, I think Hello, everybody party I mean we I hit pretty hard but they also don't hit me very hard but I'm not hitting them like hard enough to like one shot them which is odd but I guess that comes from the fact that I guess that comes from the fact that I am not leveled appropriately, so that my skills are actually not as good. Really? Come here. Okay, can I get five seconds to look at my skills? In my current state. Okay, there we go. back over here grab that and grab that all right let's try this a little bit more i mean like i get i get decent experience that's not really the issue but it's not like i don't think it's that much more experience than if i was just at stuff my appropriate level It might, it might be a, like, slightly more, but, I don't know, it was worth the experiment, I think. Oh, like, I don't have a problem that I did this. It was worth, it was worth the experimental, the experimental test, I think. Alright. 
Hello, everybody. Can we come over here? Hello, everyone. Can we all kite up here? There's got to be there's just always got to be range guys. Go. Ow, stop it with the ranged attacks. Yeah, I don't think this is not quite worth it for what I thought it would do. I mean, I feel like I would just I would cakewalk all the enemies in a normal farming area for my level. And so that's kind of where I am. It's kind of like, ooh, this is kind of pointless type of deal. Because I would just... Like, there, I one-shot those guys. But I don't one-shot... I don't one-shot everything, so... I feel like I would just be better off to one-shot stuff in a level-appropriate area. So, I don't know. It was, a, it was a good test trial. I hadn't tried it out, nor had I looked it up, so... I'm, I'm okay with that. It, it was it was worth the try, but uh, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. And the next one, we'll probably take on the next boss. I'll play on this. I'll farm up a little bit, um, do some other stuff on this character, and uh, we will go from there. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode of uh, the Dark Knight Witcher playthrough. Peace.